Hi everyone. My name is Rehan and today I am excited to introduce to you my AI powered GIS assistant for ArcGIS Pro. Built on an agentic framework that leverages large language models to automate GIS workflows intelligently. This assistant is developed using Langchain and it operates through three specialized agents. There's a planner agent which generates a structured plan for GIS tasks. Then there's a verifier agent which ensures the plan is valid and refines if it's needed. And this goes on iteratively until the plan is finalized. And then the final plan is passed to an executor agent which executes the GIS tasks automatically within IGIS Pro. By integrating AI driven decision making, this assistant significantly reduces manual effort enhances workflow efficiency and brings a new level of automation to GIS tasks. Today I'll demonstrate how this AI assistant works by solving a real world GIS problem. That is, I define locations in Delhi that do not have an ATM within a one kilometer radius. All right, so let's dive in. So let's first understand the problem. ATMs play a crucial role in financial accessibility. However, some areas may lack proper coverage, making it difficult for residents to access cash conveniently. Our goal is to find locations in Delhi where no ATMs exist within a one kilometer radius, helping urban planners and banks improve ATM placement. Now, to do this, we'll use our assistant to help us through the process, right? So, I've made some queries, uh, which I'll just copy and paste, and we'll just test it, uh, test it out, okay? So uh, first of all, uh, if we want to analyze uh, the situation for Delhi, we first of, of course need Delhi. So let's just ask it to extract Delhi, right? What it is going to do is, it is going to create a plan to get uh, Delhi, right? So before that, but although, uh, what I've done is, I've already got uh, the state boundary layer for of India. So hopefully what it is going to do is it is going to figure out that the, the, it has access to a state boundary and then it is going to create a query and extract Delhi from it. Right. So we've got it says the plan failed to return error actually due to invalid field, field name. So maybe it failed. So can we can say can you try again? All right, so the lead field or executor system and return the list valid name boundary feature class. All right. Hmm. So what potentially happened is it created a. Right, it created a, uh, a false SQL query. That's why we got an error. And now when I asked it to correct itself, uh, it was able to now uh, find the, wh what it did wrong and then finally got us uh, the boundary, administrative boundary of Delhi, right? Now we have the administrative boundary of Delhi. Now what we want uh, it to do is we want uh, the AI to get us the ATMs from the financial services located in Delhi, right? So we, we downloaded this uh, data set from OSM, right? Uh, which has, if you want to see, it has a point of post office, ATMs, banks. Right? These are all the different types of uh, locations that it has from across uh, the country. Now, what we want it to do is we want to get the ATMs from the financial services located in Delhi only. So what it has to do is the AI will have to decide that uh, it has to extract only uh, only the ATM only the ATMs right and that too from Delhi only and right so it it will know to decide which tools it, it has to use. Um, okay, so we have made the query. It's planning at the moment. It it has moved on to the verification stage. And notice that this is the first iteration. If the verification agent uh, says that the plan is not valid, uh, we move on to the second iteration where the, uh, where the feedback from the planner goes to the. OK, so let's see what happened here is. This field, right? 
uh -huh. and then successfully selected features right click features daily state does not exist right so uh, what happened is it wanted to use the first boundary remember it created the first boundary uh, to extract uh, delhi uh, but that did not work so we deleted that file and so we we need to ask it um, let's see do we have right so atms so we have the eight only the atms over here it was actually able to do get us the only the atms right but because the file that it used did not exist uh use the delhi state boundary the other delhi boundary right let's see if it understands and is able to extract uh the atms on uh, for delhi only so i'm i'm showing the problems as well uh, so that you understand uh, we can uh, uh, go back and forth with the agent and uh, help it help us right so the side feature tool because the output feature class okay so now what it tried to do is it wanted to override this file I, uh, potentially so use a different name for the output right Hmm. By the way, this this would be quite fast, but uh, we have added uh, a a, way, a delay between each request we are making to the API. So that's why it is taking. Okay, so what is it trying to do? Input feature delete temp input uh, delete feature with input feature delete response after we have tool fail because the output feature class. I'm going to delete it again. Okay, so I think let's just manually delete it. Okay. Yep. And let's say now I have deleted the temp ATM. Now get me the Get me only the ATMs for Delhi. All right, let's see what it does. So uh, I'm intentionally uh, not giving it proper information so that uh, we are able to test it, uh, test out how smart it is. Because I could uh, easily have uh, given the proper name uh, and went inside and like check the fields i wanted to use right and ask it to use that field to create the queries uh, but that that's not what i want i want to test what is it actually capable of doing so daily atm script it says right see so that's good uh right uh -huh. right in your clip features bravo right perfect so it was able to get us the ATMs of Delhi, right? All the ATMs that are placed in located in Delhi. So let's look at the last query. We are going to ask it to get me the region in Delhi which don't have ATMs within one kilometer radius. Now, this is a very uh, crucial problem, right? It now it has to create a buffer around these ATMs, then erase those buffer regions from the state of Delhi. And that's how we get uh, location, uh, locations in Delhi which don't have access to uh, ATMs, right? Or actually, which don't have uh, access to, which don't have any ATMs within one kilometer radius. So it has saved the file. Let's just refresh. And Delhi ATMs offered clipped. So no ATM areas, right? Okay. So this uh, all the yellow portion we see right those are all the areas which don't have uh, atms 
So uh, potentially these are the regions where we would want uh, to populate more ATMs. Uh, if obviously there is need, uh, there is population and we need to get them access to ATMs. So that's how uh, we can use this agent to solve uh, these sort of problems. Um, I hope you guys uh, are able to test it out soon. Uh, I'll be pushing it out uh, probably in potentially in the second week of by the end of the second week of uh, March. So I hope you are uh, looking out for it. All right. Bye. Thanks.